What's up, it's your girl here. If you don't know me, now you know me. Boom, and today we're gonna be starting something that we never did on my channel before. Now, if you've been on my channel for a while, you should know that I've done a few special effects makeup tutorials on my channel, like a Joker, Vampire, etc. etc. And today I decided, you know what, in celebration of it chapter one and two why not do a transformation video into pennywise now um i can't afford you know pennywise stuff you know the wig the outfit but since i got a few stuff to actually transform my face into him might as well try you know tell by the time i'm be transforming into pennywise or at least doing makeup to look like him i don't want to make this intro really long i just want to get into the video so let's go okay so i'm gonna pull our hair back oh oh no the hairline though okay so we start by flattening our eyebrows out with a glue stick and a spoolie brush and if you have small thin eyebrows you are lucky because later on you'll see that my long thick black dark eyebrows are not helping at all so you're lucky now i'm going to take a face paint and i'm using this micoli oil based paint and we're going to use red white black and brown for this tutorial and it came with its own brushes so we're going to take the biggest brush obviously and some white paint and put it all over her face and at this point i got so disappointed because the amount that i got from the brush is not helping and the brush is not that dense so not a lot came on my face um barely anything came on my face and the brush so as you can tell already nothing is covering my eyebrows and I did set my eyebrows with setting powder after I put glue on it, but that was off camera because I was trying to find my face powder, but yeah. Now at this point, I just gave up on the brush and went ahead and got a black dense beauty blender and blend some more face paint onto my face and tried my best to make that white face paint onto my eyebrows and not let any black show through, but it wants to be stubborn, so yay. <laughs> So I'm going to just blend more face paint down my neck so later on I'm switching to eternal neck to hide everything else. Next is the eyebrows. So we're going to take a eyeshadow palette. I'm using Take Me Back to Brazil palette. And you're going to take a black eyeshadow and start in the inner corner of your eyebrows where the bridge of your nose is and make a low line. And then drag that out making a curved high arch above your real eyebrows. Now if you have like dark eyebrows like me and the same problem I'm having right now with the covering up then you're good to go because later on you'll see that it creates that dented look that we see Pennywise has because his eyebrows look dented into his skin so having these effed up eyebrows is kind of useful so <laughs> now you could actually use gray eyeshadow or paint to start off as a guide um, and then put black over it but I don't have that so I'm just going to use black for now now is the eye look now i'm so thankful that this eye look is super simple all you need is black eyeshadow now if you want to make it dramatic and add red to it which we will do later you could do so but i'm gonna start off with black eyeshadow and we're just gonna pack that onto the lid with the eyeshadow brush and blend out the crease and make it more like faded out into our crease and i actually blend it out too much and made like a v-shape on the outer corner and i made it too high but that's okay because i'm a girl and we girls like to make things dramatic now we're going to add more black eyeshadow but instead of the on top of the lid we're going to add it underneath the eyes like so Oh, in case you didn't see it, in the bridge of my nose where between my eyebrows are, I added some little eyeshadow right there um, to make it dented also where the eyebrows crutch together. 
because he has that like angry look on his face also to make my look a little bit more realistic like his he does have little cracks in his skin later on in the it movie um and to make that effect i'm just gonna take a thin paintbrush and use a black eyeshadow and make random lines all over my face like i have veins all over my face but they're black and to make it blended into my skin i'm going to take my beauty blender and once again take some more white face paint and just pat that into my skin over the black eyeshadow time for the hard part and i only said that because red paint is not easy to get fixed on white paint so you want to take your time with this filling your lips with red it could be red lipstick or red paint i'm using paint and you want to make sure the outside corners of your lips are sharp because this is a clown look and you want to drag that out and make a curved edge where your cheeks are and then drag that going straight underneath your eyes i suggest you to look in the mirror and make it symmetrical to where your eyes are in the middle and then drag that on top of your eyelids through the fake eyebrows and you want to take your time with this once again to make sure it's perfect now it doesn't actually have to be perfect because we're going to go ahead later and take black and make an outline of it but you want to do something like this and if it goes over the fake eyebrows which you're supposed to do we go back in with black i'm going in with black paint this time and going over the eyebrows to make sure it looks like the paint is underneath the eyebrows now for the nose i know painting wise this nose is longer but i already effed up by making it big so i just like fill it in anyways so you're just basically taking red paint and fill it in the tip of your nose just like so and the nostril as well and now you're gonna go ahead and take black paint and outline the red part you just make by the way for the lips of pennywise you want to extend the bottom lip because he has huge bottom lip versus the top part but when i try to do that it didn't really work so taking a red eyeshadow like i said before and we're gonna blend out the black with the red in the crease extending the eyeshadow up because his eyebrows are all the way up <laughs> my eyebrows sticking out okay now this part is optional but i want to make my red paint a bit darker so i'm taking some brown paint and blend that into the red parts of the face and i oh and i messed up my nose great <laughs> see what i mean guys the red paint is spreading everywhere this cannot be easy <laughs> I just realized I don't have fake blood on me, so I'm just taking some red paint and putting it at the corner of my mouth and blending that out a little bit just to make it look like I just ate kids, you know? Why not? Time to contour. I'm taking a random brush and some black eyeshadow and putting that on my jawline and the forehead and taking a blending brush also and putting that black eyeshadow on the lips as well as the skinny part of the red. And that completes the Pennywise look. All you need to do now is pop on a wig if you have the Pennywise wig. I don't have that, so I got a cheap wig from Rite Aid. And there you go, guys. That's the Pennywise look. There's peanuts, cotton candy, hot dogs, and popcorn. Is that your favorite? Uh huh. Mine too. <laughs> because they pop. <laughs> pop, 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 pop. <laughs> Pop, 
take to Georgie. Egg boy! This isn't real enough for you, Billy. I'm not real enough for you! <laughs> Alright guys, so that was me transforming into Pennywise. The dancing clown. <laughs> okay, I still got this. Obviously, if I were to transform completely into Pennywise, I would have the the hair wig and the costume, but I cannot afford that because that's like probably over $100 together. I gotta say, with my eyebrows being thick and not really helping the whole look, you can see it's peeling off, but that adds a little bit of a cool effect to the whole Pennywise face because there are parts of Pennywise in the It movie both it and chapter two where his skin is actually peeling off so this kind of works out for me a little bit okay i can't do a penny wise impression but i could do tiffany ray from bride of chucky so let me try to do this 10 years is a long time chucky besides i wasn't really with him i'm not getting pain again i'll tell you that much My mother used to say once is a blessing twice is a curse we have a family now we have a child and you Shame on you. You know what my mother used to say about dirty girls? You can always smell them on girls who sell it. Alright guys, so I hope you enjoyed this video. If you enjoyed it, please give this video a big thumbs up. And if you want me to do more videos like this, which I will even after the week of Halloween is over, please comment below what you want to transform me to. And also subscribe to my channel if you're new. Join the Shirley family and hit the notification bell to be notified when I actually am uploading, which is once a week now. And also share this video with those who think they will be looking good in the Pennywise face. <laughs> Alright guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Please subscribe, rate, share, comment, all that fun stuff. And then bye. <laughs> Peace. What? What? <laughs> oh my god. Stupid boy think that I need him. Huh. I go call like changing seasons.